Peace, love, and blessings. I am back with another word. Welcome back to Trust, Obey, and Magic Ministries, where we not only learn how to be hearers of the word of God, but we also learn how to be doers of the word of God. And that's by using the three key ingredients, which is act um, to activate your faith, which is trusting the Lord with all of your heart, lead not to your own understanding, being obedient, for we know obedience is better than sacrifice, and using your imaginations when no eye has seen, when no ear has heard, even what the heart has not conceived with, of, of what the Lord has prepared for those who love the Lord. Let's jump right in. This message message um is a lyrical okay god dropped this this um song in my spirit the other day and it's called hold on we're going home and i think this is by drake so i'm gonna just read the lyrics and then i'm gonna give you the scripture and what else revelation that he gave me okay so this song says i got my eyes on you everything that you see i want your hot love and emotion endlessly i can't get over on you you left your mark on me so your person's watching you okay your person is watching you, all right? They got their eyes on you. You left your mark. You just different, okay? You got a little different different kind of razzle-dazzle to you. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just got a different ugh, energy, aura. Like, it's beautiful. It's pure. It's God, amen? And it says, I want your hot love and emotion endlessly because you're a good girl. You know it. You act so different around me. So, I don't know. For some of you, you guys may, you know... You guys may be shy in front of your person, okay? They might not, but they might not have really seen you or got the full effect of you because you know you be nervous and stuff, and it's okay, okay? That's what love do. It says because you're a good girl, you know. I know exactly who you could be. So it's like he's saying, I know exactly who you could be in my life. I know who you are, okay? Um, I know your potential as well. I see your potential, okay? And it says, just hold on, we're going home. Just hold on, we're going home. It's hard to do these things alone, okay? So he's saying we're, instead of saying I'm, he's saying we're, like we going home together, okay? It's us, It's we doing this thing together. We And I just did another message that talked about living together and stuff like that. So it says it's hard to do these things alone. This person is like, I'm done with the bachelor lifestyle. I'm done, not the bachelor, well, yeah. I'm done with the singleness lifestyle. It ain't get me nowhere. I'm tired of being alone. You know, I'm so sick of being lonely. I don't know why I just, but they sick of being lonely, okay? And it says, um, it's hard to do these things alone. Just hold on, we're going home. I got my eyes on you, you're everything that I see. So it's like, they literally, whatever move you, you go to the right, guess where their eyes is going to the right. You go to the left, guess where their eyes is going to the left. You go to the up, they to the up. You go to the down. Like when I say eyes glued on you, okay? So you could be, I don't know. They could be watching you through social media. They could be, their eyes is glued on you. Okay. So just make sure y'all act, y'all, y'all on your best behavior. And don't be trying to act, like do extra stuff to get attention. Okay. They already watching you, period. So it says, um, you're everything that I see. Okay. So they see no other, but no other person but you. Okay. These counterfeits, they already experienced what they experienced with these counterfeits. That's why. It's something about you. They can't get you out there. They can't get you out their system. Okay. It's something about you. Um, they had their share with whomever. And it's like, ah, it's something about you. And I know what it is. And it says, you left your mark on me. I can't get over you. You left your mark on me. Okay. It's the God in you. It says, I want your hot love and emotions endlessly. This person is a very passionate person. They enjoy passion and they see that you are a passionate person as well and they want your love endlessly you know forever you know always and forever <laughs> that's another song um it says because you're a good girl you know it you act so different around me because you're a good girl you know it i know exactly who you could be just hold on we're going home going home Okay, it's hard to do these things alone. Things alone. I think this is Drake. I don't know. I hope I got the name of the artist right. So it says, you're the girl. You're the one. Okay, they see you as the one. Um, Gave you everything I love. I think there's something, baby. I think there's something. You're the girl. You're the one. Gave you everything I love. I think there's something. I think there's something. Then it's, it repeats it. Because you're a good girl and you know it. You act so different around me. I know exactly who you could be. Just hold on. We're going home. Okay, and so at the time that I had received that download, right, or that song, the time was 341. So I looked up 341, and I said, wow, this is so prophetic. 341 means um, to make new. I renew, make new again. 
to renew by moving from one stage to a higher, okay? More developed one. Um, and so I was like, wow. So he's just speaking to me, speaking to me. And so I looked up and then of course the time ended up being 344, which also means to return. And so I don't know what I was looking at, but what I was looking at, I seen one, two, three. And so that's just God, you know, one, two, three, God ordering their footsteps. Okay. I did a message about them coming towards you. This is a five, five, five message. Them gaining their strength to come towards you. God is ordering their footsteps. Okay. And so the scripture that he gave me was first Peter, um, verses six. And it says, in all this, you greatly rejoice, though for a little while you may have had to suffer grief in all kinds of trials. These have come so that the proven genuineness of your faith of greater worth than gold, which perishes even through refined by fire, may result in praise, glory, and honor when Jesus Christ is revealed. It says, though you have not seen him, you love him. And even though you do not see him now, you believe in him and are filled with an inexpressible and glorious joy. For you are receiving the end result of your faith, the salvation of your soul. And you know, the other scripture he took me to was not only so, this is Romans 5, 3 through 5. And it says, not only so, but we also glory in our sufferings because we know that suffering produces perseverance and perseverance, character and character, hope. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured out into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. So guys, y'all went through a great deal of suffering. Y'all went through a great deal of trials and tribulations and even doubting the journey, even doubting God, even doubting the promise. You know what I'm saying? Even doubting circumstances because nothing was being fulfilled, okay? And so because you still remain faithful, okay, you still remain hopeful, you still was dedicated and loyal to God and you didn't curse God. You didn't, you know what I'm saying? You didn't back talk God. Some of y'all may have, you know, but God, he understands. Okay, and your 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 suffering produced hope, perseverance, and and activated your faith. God was stretching your faith, and so because you were faithful, because you were faithful, because you still held on to the promise, this is the end result. Your marriage, your promise is the end result. Okay, so y'all, you know, praise God in the midst of it. And y'all will testify. Okay. Y'all will testify. This was all for God to get the glory. It's not for nothing else, but for the God to get the glory, you know, just to prove to these naysayers, just to prove to these mockers, just to prove to these God haters that God is real. Okay. And he exists and his promise stands. And when he say he going to do a thing, he going to do a thing. Okay. And also to help others strengthen their faith as well. Okay. Because God gives all of us promises. It's all about, are we going to hold on to the promise? You know what I'm saying? Are we still going to be joyful, you know, in affliction? Are we still going to be prayerful when we, during sorrow? You know what I'm saying? And so y'all, you know, grace and peace be yours in abundance. Okay. So I congratulate you. I congratulate you. Just hold on. We're going home. Y'all going home. Okay, your husband is coming home to you. Y'all are going home together. Y'all shall be one. Okay, God is ordering and directing your person's footsteps. Okay, and this is your reward. So I congratulate you. I congratulate you. Let me make sure I don't have anything else before I shut this video down. I believe that is everything. So I pray that this message bless you. Again, I am... B Sam, Prophetess B, Brittany, Queen, your sis, whatever. Just keep it respectful. Coaching calls are still open until further notice. If you feel led to sow a seed to this ministry, know that this ground is fertile ground. Amen. Um, my, my information will be below. For emails, for testimonies, because I want to hear your testimonies, please email me at trustobeyimagineministries at gmail.com. And for prayer requests, you can also email me that um at trustobeyimagineministries at gmail.com. All of my information is in the description box below. So peace, love, and blessings. I pray you have a super amazing day. Happy Monday. Y'all be safe. And I congratulate you.